Good morning, YouTube and YouTubers and RC people. It's your boy Dave here with God Mode, God Mode RC. <clears throat> Excuse me, it's uh, it's early in the morning. I just woke up, and uh, I'm getting ready for today's RC stunt. And uh, you may have heard me talk about it a little bit, but basically, it's a dream since I had since I was a little 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 kid. Um, basically, since the first time I flew an RC plane when I was like three or four years old, um, I thought it would be super cool to fly an RC plane while sitting in a 1-1 car going down the highway, you know. I thought that would be like the coolest thing ever when I was a kid. And I never had an opportunity to do it then. I still haven't had an opportunity to do it with the RC plane. And then when I got into helicopters, I thought, oh, that'd be so cool if I could fly my helicopter alongside a 1-1, like on the highway or something. That'd be so cool. Never had an opportunity to do it with the helicopters. Now I got the street team here, and um, I think it would be cool to try to do a chase and follow video uh, with this beast. Now that I got her all dialed into perfection, I got her going about 60, 70 miles an hour plenty fast enough so what we're gonna try to do today is take a little road trip with our buddy Frank you may remember Frank from uh, uh, disc golf ninjas videos um, he is the only one nice enough or crazy enough to help me try this stunt uh, I looked into it I talked to my RC cop friend and he said it was perfectly legal so we're gonna go for it <clears throat> Uh, basically, the plan is um, communication with Frank is always tough. Uh, his English isn't the best, and I don't always understand what he's talking about. But I guess the basic plan is we're going to try to drive my RC car uh, to the next town over, Orchid. Uh, it's about eight to ten mile drive. We've got to take the back roads. We're going to go down uh, uh, Kenny Malenko Highway which is out there in my old speed run spot and then we're going to try to drive this beast all the way to um, Orchid. <clears throat> now this is something that me and Frank have been talking about and planning for well over a year um, you know I, I, I basically hit up all my friends about the concept and none of them were really interested except Frank um, I think he's just such a nice guy that he can't say no. That's what I think. But regardless, he's willing to do it. He's, uh, he's, a, he's a pretty good driver, and he's got a quick little Jetta, so uh, he should have no problem keeping up with this beast. But uh, he has a little experience with RC. I let him drive the ECX before, and he did pretty good. Um, so, I mean, he's got a little RC experience, and, you know, he's a pretty good driver, so I think it, he'll do just fine. So, um, I'm a little nervous, because it's kind of crazy. It's something I've never really tried before, but, you know, like I said, it's a childhood dream, and it's something that me and Frank have been planning for a while, and today is the day that we're going to attempt it. It rained a little bit last night. I haven't seen the streets yet. I don't know how wet they are. Hopefully they're not too wet because this thing's splash proof, but it's not waterproof. Um, so, it's been done before, the whole chase follow thing in the RC. I get that. It's been done before, okay? Originally, when we had planned the stunt, the plan was to put a uh, action camera on this thing. And I bought, uh, I tried, I bought a shock mount for the action camera, and the problem was that the, the setup was just too heavy, and it was putting too much stress on the truck, and it wasn't driving right. So we had to scrap that idea. So then I bought a very small action camera, a very small, very light action camera, and I was going to mount that to an anti vibration shock pad, and, um, I was going to mount it to this thing to do the onboard for the stunt. Well, the camera never came, of course. Uh, just like my camera gauge I, I bought on eBay, never made it. They never made it. 
Uh, we have had issues with people stealing our mail and stuff around here, but regardless, uh, it never made it. Um, which sucks because we don't have any on, we're not going to get any onboard footage today. But I still have the 4K action camera and I'm going to strap that to my head and hopefully Frank's windshield is clear enough that you guys can see some of the stunt. So you know me, I, I certainly will try my best, but um, you know the quality is not always the highest with this channel, but we do the best we can here. You guys got to understand, you know, I've been out of work for a long time. I have no money. Um, I've just been surviving off little side jobs I can do here and there, so it's not like I have a lot of money to pour in this race team. You know, I've just been chipping away in it over the last two years. So <clears throat> I'm all about pleasing my inner child because my inner child has had it rough. Um, I had a rough childhood and I've had a rough adulthood, and um, I want my inner child to be happy. So. Uh, the ten-year-old version of me has always wanted to do this stunt, and uh, today we're gonna try it. So wish us luck, pray for us. I hope everything goes right. Uh, I'm not gonna be able to capture it live, obviously, because there's no Wi-Fi out where we're going. But. Um, Hopefully everything goes smooth and we can do the stunt and uh, the plan is I think we're going to drive to Orchid on 3S and then uh, if she's fast enough on 2S we're going to drive her back on 2S. So that's the plan. Basically take this thing on a 15, 20 mile, now, uh, 20 mile road trip today down farm roads. So that's the plan. I don't. That's the plan as far as what I understand it. Now Frank may have a completely different idea. I'm not sure what. Frank has planned as usual, but um, you know, uh, hopefully we're on the same page as far as this stunt goes. Because I really want it to go smooth, and I want to be able to do it first try. So that's that. Uh, Frank's going to be here about half an hour, and uh, I'm just going over the last minute things, making sure everything's ready to go on this beast, and then uh, we're going to get out there and uh, do this epic stunt for you guys. It should be awesome. Um, but everything has to go right for it to work so I can't remember the last time everything gone right but I'm gonna stay optimistic I'm gonna stay positive uh, I'm gonna say uh, the Lord's Prayer which is something that I say almost every day um, and uh, let's go ahead and do that now while we're here please pray with me our Father who art in heaven hallowed be thy name thy kingdom come thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever and ever. Amen. P.S. Please bless my friends and family and all the good people and all the children and this race team. Lord, please let us have a smooth stunt today. And uh, all the glory goes to you. Amen. God in the highest, guys. Thanks for watching. Next time you see me, we'll be out of the road. Peace.